I really hope you can hear that. It's thunderstorming. It's gorgeous. I'm just gonna curl up in my chair and read, I think, all day.
Hello my loves, I hope you're all doing okay. I don't actually have too many updates for this week. Um, there's really not been much going on. I've not been up to much, um, but I do have a couple things that I wanna talk about. The first one being um, that I have finally gotten over my book hangover that Daisy Jones and the Six put me in. Um, and so I finished two books in the past couple of days and it's been so lovely. I've had a great time. Um, the books that I've read are A Restless Truth and A Power Unbound. Uh, these are the last two books in the trilogy that starts with A Marvelous Light. Um, and I first read A Marvelous Light almost a year ago. Uh, it took a, a long while for me to pick up the second book. Uh, but I read, what's that called? I read A Restless Truth and then immediately picked up A Power Unbound and I devoured it. It was really good. Um, I gave A Restless Truth four and a half stars and A Power Unbound definitely five stars. Uh, there's just something about the like romantic dynamic in this one that just like tickles my fancy. Um, I thoroughly enjoyed it and the magic system in this universe is brilliant um, and the way things unfold in this one, A Power Unbound, yeah, I just really liked it um, and so yeah, I've, I've been reading which is so lovely. We're going back to my booktube days. Um, <laughs> But yeah, I read these two books and loved them. Uh, highly recommend, actually. Um, and I think the next book that I'm going to read is My Year of Rest and Relaxation. Um, I've hesitated to pick this up for a long time because I know this has kind of a lot to do with depression. And for those of you who don't know, I... yeah... That's a thing in my life, and so I don't want to, like, unintentionally trigger myself by reading this. But I feel like now's a good time. I don't know, there's just something calling me to this book, so I think I'm going to start this. Um, and yeah, we'll see how I like it. We'll see. Um, in terms of journaling... Um, I did actually start a second Morning Pages. Um, I think how I put this is different from Volume 1 because there's more of the text showing. Um, but that's kind of irrelevant. I, I'm a little bit through. I'm still, I'm still writing every day. Um, so... Yeah, that's that, I suppose. Um, and then in terms of my makeshift rings, um, I'm still waiting on the cover to come. Um, but I think the last time I checked in, this was the spread I was working on, um, which is done. Um, and so I did this spread about my room. I printed off some pictures of like my chair and my desk and did a little writing about uh, making my room my sanctuary. Um, and so I have the definition of sanctuary here. Um, but yeah, there's that. And then I did a spread on Desire Paths because it came across my For You page on TikTok and I got obsessed. So I went on Reddit and found a bunch of pictures. I printed off these two. Um, but yeah, I really quite like the idea of Desire Paths. Um, I feel like I mentioned this before, um, like a while ago actually, but I really like the idea of mundane human history, uh, which is why I got into cassettes in the first place. And Desire Paths are exactly that. It's just humans leaving their mark on the world and in like super mundane ways. I really like it. I like the idea. I just, I, I love Desire Paths so much. Um, I'm not fully in love with how this spread looks, 
but they can't all be beautiful works of art. Um, so yeah, I did that. And then the Wolf Star paper clips, I think I talked about. And then this was when I went to visit my sister. Uh, so we did a photo booth thing. And so I stuck in the picture there. And then the last thing I have uh, for my February spreads in my makeshift rings is uh, my new lock screen. I found this art of Regulus Black. Um, it's by Suzy Oko Art. Uh, I'm obsessed. I love this so much. And it just makes me happy looking at my lock screen. And I wanted to have like a documentation of a mundane thing like that. Uh, but yeah, th that's it for spreads. Um, I still need to write my reviews on A Restless Truth and A Power Unbound but I'll do that today. Um, but yeah, those are those updates. Now I did actually, I did actually print out my March pages. And so these are the Franklin Covey compact size. Now <laughs> it doesn't look that much bigger than um, the ones that I've current that I'm currently using, which are meant to be the file facts personal. Um, and that's because I measured wrong. <laughs> so my file facts personal pages are actually four inches wide. So that means the Franklin Covey compact pages are only a quarter of an inch wider. Um, <laughs> but that's okay. It's fine. It's an experiment. Math does not always math in this brain of mine. Um, but yeah, this was an experiment anyways, so it's okay that the pages aren't fully accurate in dimensions. Um, but yeah, these ones are, I think they're three dot grid spaces wider. And I mean, I haven't used these yet, but I have hopes that it's going to make a massive difference. Um, but yeah, so I printed these out, glued them together, hole punched them with my beautiful six hole punch now. I own one now, guys. It's great. Um, the, the earth is shifting. Um, but yeah, I'm still waiting on the cover to come in the mail. It should hopefully come next week, but I might have to wait like three more weeks for it to come. Um, anyways, I have my monthly, um, and I've populated it with some of the things that I have going on. Um, and then these are my weeks. I actually really like this layout. I have just a mini calendar of the month. And then this is essentially what my weeks look like anyways. Um, but yeah, I'm excited to start using this layout. Hopefully it's like actually okay. Um, and then I changed up my statistics page. I'm still not fully sold on this particular layout. I feel like I need to adjust the spacings of some things, but I combined my reading stats and my music stats all into one thing. Um, and yeah, I think that's gonna be great. And then I have my days read where I combined my physical and audiobook reading. Um, and then I have my fan fiction reading. I don't know, something about it. I think this is going to work. I think this is going to be good. Um, and then, yeah, same media log. I do think I need to change the heading a little bit uh, just because in comparison to these, um, the pen size I used was not the same. So I think I need to adjust that on my media log. But other than that, um, these are my March pages. Uh, <laughs> yeah, I need to do a little cover page. Um, I'm not entirely sure what I'm gonna do just yet. It's not the first of March yet, that's tomorrow. Um, but, yeah, I just, I'm so eager to have my cover so that I can actually use this as it's intended. But 
yeah um I don't really know what else to say um that's kind of all my updates I've been reading a lot and I'm excited to continue reading uh finally um and yeah my pages are are pretty much are pretty much set um I do need to make a few changes and yeah I don't I don't really know um I'm trying to think if I have something going on but I don't so we're just taking it easy we're just taking it easy and we'll see how we'll see where um the day takes us <laughs> the weekend takes us we'll see um yeah okay I'm gonna go and I'll talk soon <laughs>
this wasn't meant to come for another couple days, but I'm so happy it's actually here. <laughs> this is my rings planner. Um, this is the brand that I got it from, Peach Love Bag on Etsy. Uh, okay, yeah, I'm so excited. Let's have an open. I'm just gonna leave that there for now. Oh my god, I'm so excited. Oh my god. I'm so excited. <laughs> Ridiculous. Okay. Yep. A lovely little front pocket. It came with a bunch of paper. Um, and then another, oh my gosh, a pen loop. What? That's exciting. Um, let's see if it fits my pen. It does actually. That's quite lovely. It fits. Um, but it doesn't fit nicely with paper in it. But that's okay. Um, okay. Uh -huh. All right. And my pages. Let's see. There is a little bit of overhang, but not too much. That's not bad. I'm quite pleased with that. Quite pleased, actually. Um, I do, however, need to get something to protect my pages because they got quite worn um, by the leather. Yeah, not sure how much you can actually see that, but that's like the pen loop on this one and then the front pocket on this one here. This pocket on the pages. And I don't want my pages to get damaged like that. Not like they're damaged, but like, that's just not what I want on my pages. So, yeah, we'll see. That's, I'm so excited. Oh my God. 